Yellow adipose tissue, H and E staining. The specimen is yellow adipose tissue in the subcutaneous tissue after routine histological staining with H and E. The presented type of connective tissue, which is an effective thermal insulator, also protects against mechanical trauma and is involved in the storage of nutrients. The cross section shows hair follicles with lobules of yellow adipose tissue located in between. Within the lobules, large cells are visible, almost the entire interior of which is filled with a single lipid drop. It is surrounded by a narrow border of cytoplasm stained pink with eosin. The hematoxylin stained nucleus and other cell organelles are located in its widest point. Fat cell cytoplasm content is a morphological adaptation to the functions it performs. Hence, the presence of multiple mitochondria and a well-developed smooth endoplasmic reticulum. Due to the peripheral location of the nucleus and the presence of a single lipid drop pushing the cytoplasm towards the periphery, the shape of a yellow fat cell is compared to a signet ring. This appearance is even more pronounced due to the empty area left by the fat drops that are dissolved out during the staining procedure. In order to make the content of the fat-containing vacuole visible, it is necessary to use fat-soluble dyes, such as oil red. Increasing interest is being shown in yellow adipose tissue as a source of stem cells. Unlike bone marrow stem cells, they have the potential to differentiate into many types of cells, not only those derived from blood. Furthermore, it is not without significance that the acquisition of adipose tissue by liposuction is a virtually painless procedure.